Do you want unlimited control of your phone? Get around the restriction that manufacturers or carriers may have applied to your device? Well, this is the right video for you. In this video, I'll show you how to route your Samsung Galaxy Note 4 to have unlimited control of what happens in your device. So without further ado, let's do it. So the first thing you have to do here is identify your phone model number. And to do that, just go to the settings, scroll down to about device and look for model number. My model number here is SMN910C. Yours might be different and this is very important because the file of CA, CF auto root that we are going to download must be compatible with your device model. The second thing we have to do is enable developer options. So once again, go again to, to the settings, scroll down to developer options. As you can see, my developer option here is enable. If in your case, it doesn't appear there, what you have to do is go back again to about device, scroll down to build number and tap seven times to enable develop option so as you can see mine says no need develop mode has already been enabled so in your car in, so in your case probably will say build seven times to tap seven times to enable develop option once you once you've done that just go back to develop options click on that here what we have to do is just tick on USB debugging which is right here yours might be this way so you have to click there to enable USB debugging so once we have done that the next thing to do is download the files that we are going to need which is Odin and CF auto root for your device now let's switch to the computer. The link for the files are in the description section. So go ahead and download them. Now here what we are going to do is extract the file we have downloaded. I already have downloaded and extracted the files. So let's open it. The files we are going to use here are Odin and the CF auto root file. So the first thing we have to do here is run Odin. Now let's boot our phone into download mode. So to do that, shut down the phone. Okay, now press power button, volume down and home button at the same time. So there you go. Press up to continue. So there is the phone into download mode. The next thing to do is connect the device with the PC. Once connected, you can see that it appears here at the log, edit, and you got this blue sign here, which means the device is connected. Next step is click on AP to import the CF auto root file. Once the file is imported, the next thing to do is click on start. Once we see 
this block filled with green and reset option up here. That means we have successfully installed the file and our device will automatically begin the routing process. So let me just put here my code. And at the end, we have this green pass which means we have successfully installed root in our device. Once your device has rebooted, next thing to do is download root checker. I already have downloaded so let's just open it so once we open just let's click on verify root grant super user access and there you go guys the device is rooted the next thing to do is verify that during this process of installation the super user application is installed in the device. As you can see, we have here the super SU application installed in the device. Well, that's all for this video guys. I hope you like it. And if you did, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a nice day.